In today's video, we talk about goals. what's going on this is Paul Ravella from ProPhysique.com and I'm gonna be very brief today I want to get this video out had something on my mind it's Monday afternoon and I had a very long weekend uh, I left early Saturday and didn't get back till Sunday night at about 1 30 in the morning so I've got a lot of catching up to do on work having said that I've got a lot of like energy and uh, focus this week because there's so much positive stuff going on, especially with the events of the weekend, which I'll get into in some of the later videos this week. But today's video, I mostly wanted to touch on the idea of uh, having clear and defined goals because I had some clients compete this weekend and they all met or exceeded their expectations and the goals we set. And whether or not you compete, it does not matter. That is not something that is going to uh, manage how successful you are, but there is something that you can do that can help you be successful and that is setting clear goals. I can't tell you enough when I get a client inquiry or I get someone that I talk to that says, hey, you know, you look great or I'm interested in getting in shape, what should I do? The first step is defining what your goal is because once you define that goal, you're going to hold yourself accountable to it. So if you've been kind of hemming and hawing on what's going on in your life right now, like you don't know your next event or your next thing that you're doing, you're just not sure, I promise you if you set a clear defined goal, if you set that next uh, project in motion for yourself, it doesn't have to be physique related either. Set it in motion, write it down, get it started, it's going to become very real. The one thing about hiring a coach, when my client pays me, that is motion. We are starting the process. Same thing with a lot of the things that I have going on with my business right now. Uh, as you see my man Steven over here working. Uh, um, you know, Steven and I got some awesome stuff going on for Pro Physique right now. Lots of projects coming up in the future, you know, from uh, the bodybuilding show, the camps, we're traveling, we're going to be at the Europa in a couple weeks. Just lots of cool things going on and whenever I have these kind of thoughts in my mind and they're not really fully formed but I think they're a good idea, I put them down on my, my idea board back there and that makes them real and then we start moving forward. So my simple thought for today for you guys is think about what it is that you want to accomplish and start setting even small goals to obtaining that larger, bigger picture goal that you have and don't think of it as such a, a giant process. Think of it as things that you, you tick along the way and I know this isn't uh, my typical video where I'm giving you like specific nutrition or training advice or things like that. but all of those nutrition and training goals are secondary to actually setting and defining a clear goal and um, I'm going to give you guys some footage so I just want to give you a little bit of update on the house so the construction has begun on the the garage and when I mean construction I mean it's going up now so we actually have block and it's been completed the block is in they're going to be filling in the block with concrete um, this week and then the trusses are going to be up this weekend so the roof will actually be on very soon um, and the electrical is in in my kitchen so that means hopefully the end of this week early next week the cabinets are going in and then from there I have a kitchen someday so I just wanted to keep you guys up to date on all of that so this weekend was amazing I'll give you guys just a, some some brief information um, went to Ormond Beach with Troy as you guys may or may not know Troy came over from South Africa and spent the week in Tampa. We got to train together, eat together, talk together. The guy just gets it. He really loves the process. He really enjoys it. And uh, so we went over to the NGA Gator Classic in Ormond Beach, a natural bodybuilding show. Saw some fantastic physiques. Saw some of my friends in the natural bodybuilding community here in Central Florida. Went great. Troy got second in the men's physique open class. And uh, he went home a very happy man and he's already got his sights set on his next competition in the UK so we're going to be working towards that goal which goes back to the point of this video Troy has already set his next clear defined goal right so then from Ormond Beach for those that aren't familiar with Florida uh, Tampa is on the west coast of Florida Ormond Beach is all the way on the east coast and then from there I drove straight south three hours to go to West Palm Beach on Sunday because the NPC Florida Grand Prix uh, had a two-day show, Saturday with the men, Sunday with the women. So it was very cool. I had two clients competing and I got to see them. And 
that's not always the case, but man, when you get to be there on show day, when I was there for Troy and getting to be there for, for Amy and Lauren, it's just the best feeling in the world. And I'm really making an effort to be at more shows this year. And uh, sometimes I can, I can hem and haw during the week, like knowing I have to travel, but nothing, nothing feels better than being there. And so both of them did very well. Uh, Amy took third in the open class F making her nationally qualified and she is a master's competitor so we're considering master's nationals setting that next goal lauren dannon miller she gets the star for the weekend lauren has not competed for two years she got nationally qualified two years ago and has set her sights on the uh, bikini olympia stage which is very lofty but she has the talent and the the hard work to get there so the goal for this year was to get nationally qualified and do some national shows well guess what she won her class uh, class E and got nationally qualified. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing to you the 2017 Divine Nutrition Florida Grand Prix yeah. overall bikini open champion and the newest cover model of Doral Magazine. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. won the overall and so exceeding expectations just doing awesome things got some good feedback from the judges and in two weeks she will be hitting the national stage and we'll just see how it goes from there but again show's over she called me this morning we set that next goal we know what's happening and uh we're going to take her to nationals and do some great things so that's it guys, I want to be brief today because um, one thing about you know traveling and stuff, I don't get to keep up on work as well, but that's what Mondays are for, getting it done. And uh, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. We'll talk about some more specific things. If you have questions, if you have comments, probably gonna have a video this week with Lauren Dandemanilla. We're gonna talk about uh, her process, her journey a little bit, um, all the great things that she's got going on. But other than that, I'm gonna be doing some, you know, some. I have some great ideas for videos related to the uh, the publication of Mass, uh, the monthly application of Strength Sport, and we'll talk about um, some of the research that's going on in there. And uh, if you guys have any specific videos you're interested in, I'm always all ears. Comments, questions below, and uh, I will talk to you guys tomorrow.